when it comes to permissions in um, jira people get confused sometimes with the uh, how to set up the permissions when it comes to especially when it comes to blocking certain users from a certain uh, projects now this is uh, a very common question on uh, uh, on the community so this question is asked by bianca and uh, bianca is asking about uh, we have multiple projects on our jira account some require different vendors we do not want our vendors to see the other projects we are working on but do not know how to block them from seeing specific projects and only have access to the ones they are working on now doing this is uh, not very difficult um, especially if you have a paid account so you need to go to the project settings and i'm talking about uh, a classic jira software project when you go to project settings you can go to the permissions and when you go to permissions you can take a look at or you can focus on this particular permission called browse projects now right now browse projects permission is given to in my case in my instance is given to um, application access any logged in user so it means that if i add any user in my jira instance on cloud that user can access this project now what you may want to do is you should limit this uh, permission to only a project role so what you can do here is when you modify the permission scheme don't modify the default scheme use your own scheme that you can also reuse on other projects now when you modify the project scheme you can first remove the any logged in user from the application access and then only add a specific role now roles the, the, the good thing about using a role is that when you are uh, working with roles your team um, or rather i should say your project admin the person who is uh, working or basically responsible for the project can manage the team now if you look uh, look at the people here and uh, when you look at uh, the current roles so you have right now um i mean i have right now no role uh no one added to a role so because i'm using a free version of uh, jira cloud i can't modify it but usually you have the option to add people to different different roles so you can have different roles like uh, project managers project sponsors and uh, developers and so on and these roles are something that you can create and when you create these roles use these roles in the permission scheme so let us say if you want uh, a vendor to access only the, only his or her own project you can just give or you can create a role here called vendor and in the permission scheme give the browse project permission to the vendor now when you create a project with this particular uh, configuration where, where where browse project is given to where browse project permission is given to vendor the project admin or maybe you as a jira administrator can then add people to or actual vendors to the vendor role now when you add people to the vendor role those people who will have uh, who have been added to who to to this particular role will get access to only that particular project and that is how you can manage the permissions where you want to limit their access to only a specific project so it is all about using the right uh, permission scheme and use that permission scheme you can have multiple permission schemes but if you have a similar configuration for these vendor projects so maybe you can create a vendor permission scheme where the browse project permission is given to only the vendor role and then uh, you can easily manage it or your project admin can manage it i think it is better to let individual project administrators project managers project leads to manage this because uh, it will take the burden off 
your uh, uh, your shoulders because you as as, as a jira administrator it is your it is your responsibility to create a framework or create these configurations and give it to the project admin and then it is up to the project administrators to manage the manage who they want to add to their project so i hope this clarified and uh, it was helpful so this is all i wanted to share in this video i hope you enjoyed watching this video and you learned something new today thank you very much